Hello, this is Liz. Welcome to my little urban homestead. I'm going to have a go at Michelob today. Uh, got this turkey thigh mint. There's a pound of it there. And that goes. You can't see it too well, but always check. You don't want cookies with the paper still attached. <laughs> um, different recipes I've seen have used out tip. So here goes some oats, about half a cup, and about got a chopped onion here. Well, two small ones, and two cloves of garlic, and they're going in. Oh, yes, I like garlic. oh boy. <laughs> Uh, what else now? I want it fairly plain. So, a bit of pepper, salt. Some people seem to add a Worcester sauce. I haven't got much of this in actually. But there goes a bit of Worcester sauce. I suppose that's a tablespoon. And a bit of soy sauce, about the same amount. And a good squeeze of this tomato paste. So, how much is that? Would you say? I suppose that's a third of a cup, something like that. have some fresh herbs in it and that which I haven't got so top um, I'll leave it at that and just get your hands in and mix it all up now there should be uh, well, there's not as much fat in turkey as in beef or anything, so that's why I greased my pan. But as soon as it's all mixed up and combined, I'm not sure that there's enough to mold the puree there. This is why I only mix with just one hand, then I can still use my other hand to open containers. I suppose you could put an egg in this, but my chickens aren't laying as much now. It's not light for as long. So I'm saving the eggs, but that's basically it. So, okay, roughly the size of your pan. And put it in the oven, gas mark 6, um, which I believe is about 400 degrees, for about 45 minutes um, to an hour. 
and while the oven is on I'm going to be cooking some other things. It's a pearl.